Hey, meet your pelvic floor. There are multiple muscle groups within your pelvic floor, which is why it's important to take into consideration what these muscles are doing and how they're functioning during exercise. So your pelvic floor is where your vagina and anus call home. It also helps to support the organs within your pelvis to keep them on the inside of your body. If muscles are functioning well, then you wouldn't experience some of the common pelvic floor dysfunctions that we know of, right? Like stress urinary incontinence, so you're not gonna be peeing your pants, pelvic organ prolapse, so you're not gonna be feeling something falling out or any pressure or bulging down below. Other things to look for would be pain with intercourse or going to the bathroom, straining when you're going to the bathroom, and this is both number one and number two. We experience some of these symptoms like pelvic organ prolapse. It's important to note that there are ways outside of surgery that can help you get back to the heavy, sweaty stuff that you love. First up, it's becoming better educated on how your pelvic floor functions for you. This is a unique process for every single woman and there's a lot of interesting things that we need to take into consideration. But once we find your best starting point, we can take that and progress you from there. This means your pelvic floor is actually just as adaptable as you are.